Hey everybody, forgot to do a, a video this morning. I broke camp around 6 o'clock. Sorry about the noise in the background. I'm sitting here at McDonald's having lunch. Just finished uh, taking a break. Uh, I've got uh, 33 miles in so far today. Um, and the next good campground that I want to go to is uh, like uh, 20 miles away. Uh, 20, um, so I've got another... Uh, um, three or four hours of bike riding. Um, taking a break here for a couple hours hopefully gives my time, legs time to, to rest and um, the lactic acid to, to uh, um, settle down uh, so I don't get leg cramps. I woke up this morning, I felt great. Uh, no leg cramps, had, some, had a leg cramp during the night. I had some leg cramps before I went to bed, but um, I woke up feeling good, no problem. I uh, did the 33 miles, have had no problem. So uh, we'll see how another 22 does uh, after a couple hour and a half break. And um, I will definitely do a wrap up tonight. Um, sorry I didn't do uh, something this morning before I left, but uh, just tried to get on the road. I got on the road by 6.30 in the morning. Um, I got here to McDonald's at uh, 10.30. Um, so um, let's see. Uh, <laughs> Uh, five hours uh, to do uh, 33 miles. Not too bad, uh, especially since I've been doing hills as well. I think I had, today I have like tw um, 2,500 foot elevation change up and down, uh, which is about the same as I had yesterday. So I'm glad to uh, um, give an update and uh, I'll give an update tonight. And if I have a cell service, which I think I will, because I'm staying at a, uh, at a uh, public campgrounds and they normally have some Wi-Fi, I'll post this. Talk to you later. Hey everybody, I'm here at Duck um, Duck Puddle uh, Campgrounds. Um, did a uh, 54 and a half mile day in uh, just less than eight hours. But an hour and a half of that, I sat at McDonald's having uh, lunch and taking a rest. Uh, much better uh, with leg cramps today. I did have a couple while I was riding the bike, but I rode through them. Wasn't able to do that yesterday. But uh, nice little campgrounds here. That's where I'm spending the night. And... Uh, it's supposed to rain tomorrow, so I've got a, a short day, a 35-mile day scheduled tomorrow rather than the 50-mile day. Um, and uh, I will definitely be doing some video tomorrow uh, when it's not raining. Um, you know how I am with the, the phone in the rain. I'm worried about uh, damaging the phone. I did that already once. So just wanted to give you an idea. Um, <laughs> a couple things I've learned while doing this. One is for all my hiker friends out there, uh, one of the nice things about riding a bike is when you get to the top of the hill, you get to ride down. When you're hiking, you don't get to do that. You still have to walk, um, expend a lot of energy walking down the hill. Um, at least with riding the bike, you spend all that energy hiking, climbing the hill. But when you get to the top, you get to a little break when you ride down. Um, the other thing is it's uh, hard to uh, get started with that trailer, um, especially if you're going uphill. And a couple times I've had to push the bike up the hill because uh, um, they had a stop sign in the middle of the hill and all of a sudden you have to try to go get started and there's not a good way to get started pulling that trailer. Um, it's not too bad when it's flat, but uh, going uphill is a little challenging. So had a couple places where I manually pushed up the, the rest of the hill. Um, had a good day. It was a beautiful day out today. Um, and... Uh, Sorry, I haven't been uh, stopping and taking pictures of the site. Um, I'm more concerned with uh, making sure that uh, I get to my campsite and uh, and um, um, and how uh, I'm feeling for the day. Uh, I'll try to do more uh, stopping and taking pictures of some of the things I'm seeing. Um, that's another thing. When you're when you're hiking the AT, it's called the Green Tunnel because basically you're walking through. Uh, tr the trees and sometimes it is just a tunnel with uh, uh, with the uh, shrubs and stuff beside you. I took pictures of that before. Well, when you're on the road, there's always stuff stuff to look at. So and also I spend less time looking at my feet when I hiked the AT. You had to look at your feet a lot because of all, all the rocks and roots. So some differences. Enjoying my time out here and glad you guys could join me.